All right, well, uh, we're out here in the turkey woods. Got our butts whipped again today. Didn't see nothing but uh, do a little gear review for you, a little setup for what I'm doing for my 2020 turkey season and the stuff I'm using. All right. So pack up and head to a new spot I'll show you how I was set up this morning I got two decoys here top of the power line and uh, there's a big hill right here and I was just tucked up here against the hill just sitting up here on the hill and uh, using that kind of as my my backstop here to kind of take away the silhouette and uh, the Sun was peeking right over this this morning it was I was invisible over here. I mean, I had deer at 10 yards, and uh, they had no clue I was here. But yeah, that's my setup. Decoys are about seven yards away. I'm trying to keep it pretty close with the struggle stick. You can't see it right there. I'm using a recurve this year. So, uh, yeah, making it tough on myself, but, uh, we're gonna try to get it done. Haven't even seen a bird yet this year. Haven't even heard a gobble. But uh, we're gonna move around. We're gonna find them. And uh, all right. And my uh, decoys I'm using are the Primos uh, Jake and the uh, Primos Hen decoy. They're uh, they're pretty realistic. I like them. But yeah, that's a. Uh, just a waterproof pad that I sit on. I got a my Elite Origin 45 pound recurve and uh, we'll go through the pack show you what's in there. Alright, alright. Here is uh, my recurve. It's a 45 pound Elite Origin and uh, I did a review on my bow and the broadheads and everything I use if you want to check that video out. But uh yeah, here's the uh, the backpack. That's my monster I had this morning. But yeah, let's uh, let's break into the bag here. Camo netting, and uh, all right, let's see what we got in the bag. All right, here's the pack I'm using this year. It's just a a 70 liter hiking pack. I got a couple water bottles, one on each side here. I got my GoPro, a little turkey fan, and um, in the top in here I got an extra beanie, face paint, a flashlight, um, Compton traditional uh, Field notes. Use that when I'm scouting a lot. Um, face paint, chapstick. And then, uh, in here I got a the glass signal eleven turkey turkey ops. I got the bat wing. Uh, little condensation I had in my mouth all morning. It's the bat wing turkey call. And then um, in here I got my license tag, uh, first aid kit, um, an extra string and a stringer for my bow. And um, I also got a camo poncho in there for if it's raining, just toss that on. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much my gear. Keep it basic, keep it simple, and uh, stay mobile. That's the main thing. Here in the public, got to stay mobile. And uh, find the birds. I'm struggling a little bit this year, but uh, 
We've only been out twice. It's only third day of season. We'll get on them. All right, this is what my pack looks like. Uh, all packed up. I'll throw my decoys in the bag. Strap it on the pack and show you that. All right, so, so that's all strapped up here. Uh, decoys strapped on. I'll throw her on and hike out of here and uh, show you what it looks like on my back. All right, well, uh, I got it all set up here and strapped on my back and uh, about to hike out of here. Um, I like it all on my back like this, makes it easy. It's a little heavy, you know, but keeps me mobile for uh, coming deep in on some of this public land down here. So, yeah, there's my setup. It's my pack. And uh, Primos, one tip here, Primos comes, their bag comes with like an orange flap. I would recommend if you're carrying decoys on your back or even at all, just put something orange over it so you don't get shot, you know. There's some wild people out here. But, uh, yeah, stay safe and uh, like, subscribe, stay tuned, and uh, I'll see you in the woods.